Hello friends, welcome back to another video. In this video, I will be providing you the solution of our Arcade Level 2 Citizen Developer Skills Second Catalog Foundations First Lab that is Google App Sheet getting started. This lab ka solution provide karunga and this lab would be very easy. And before starting the solution, I simply want to inform you that I already uploaded the solution of the level 1. Level 1 ki kaafi sai lab solution upload ho chuki hai. Aur ye jo first lab hai, iska solution bhi upload ho chuka hai. To jaake aap check kar sakte hai by simply clicking on the i button of the video, you will get the playlist of each and every solution. Jaise aap video ke i button pe click karenge, aapko playlist mil jayegi, usme sare solution honge. Okay, without wasting time, start this, open it and wait for the page to be loaded up. Page load hone denge. So once the page get loaded, simply click on the start lab button and wait for the credentials. Okay, credentials will come and then we will log in in our account and we will perform the task. Okay, so simply right click upon open Google Cloud Console and open it in new private window. Actually, uh, not Google Cloud Console, it's App Sheet, Google App Sheet. This time we are working in App Sheet mein work kar rahe and we need to sign in with the Google. Okay, so click on this Google. Make sure you log in in the incognito tab. You have to open the incognito tab in the incognito tab, otherwise you have to face the problems. Okay, now we need to copy this username. We will use this username as the email ID. Okay, so come back to here, paste it under the here, click on the next button. Now we need the password. So for the password, come back to the lab, copy the password. Password copy karenge, ye given hai Yaha par aenge, paste the password here, click on the next button and we get logged in into our Google app sheet. Okay, so click on the I understand button. It's a welcome message. Now scroll down, click on this allow button. We need to accept this. Now once we get logged in, simply come back to the lab, click on this task one. It will redirect you to the task one. Now, what you need to do? Simply right click upon this contact spreadsheet. It is an embedded link. It's make link is embedded. Hai. So, you right click karna hai and open it in private window. Okay, wait for it to get open. While it's opening, simply come back to the lab and copy this name that is personal contact. Copy it very carefully. Don't copy any full stop. And which full stop ever copy nahi karna hai. Come back to the console again. Wait for it to get loaded. It's a Google Sheet. Now, click on this file button. We need to make a copy of this file and click on this make a copy button we need to rename this with the name that we just copied and click on the make a copy button okay and it will generate a copy of this google spreadsheet now simply come back to the lab click on this check my progress and you will get the green tick for sure let's wait a second it's showing some latency don't worry now you can see we get the green tick now scroll down to the next task now we need to create a app sheet under the uh, actually we need to create an app under the app sheet ui so what you need to do simply scroll down and uh, come back to the console and open the first tab jo hamara first tab tha my app sheet ka isko open karenge ise cut kar lete hain click on this now what you need to do you need to create a new app so simply click on this create button and we will click on this app and click on start with existing data okay so we will use that uh, personal contact spreadsheet jo humne co copy banayi thi spreadsheet ki wo wala data hum yahan par use karenge so come back to the lab and copy this customer contact as a name we will use uh, use it as the app name so copy it very carefully dhyan se copy karenge koi bhi extra spacing nahi honi chahiye come back to here remove this app name it is previously given to us first of all remove it uh, it's showing some delay or latency don't worry let me check yes now it's working remove the name and paste the name that we just copied and for the category let's see what is the category and the category is the customer engagement okay so come back to here click on this and uh, select customer engagement now we can click on this choose your data then click on this google sheet when then we need to select the spreadsheet so wait for it to appear we will select the personal contact spreadsheet it's loading so once it's get it's get loaded you will see your personal contact spreadsheet if in your case aapko ye personal contact spreadsheet na dikhe to aapko again google sheet open karni hai personal contact wali aur isko ek baar refresh kar lijiye aur reload kar lijiye aapko sheet dikh jayegi now you need to click on this and you need to select it okay now what you need to do you are done with this task also now you need to add a contact address okay so scroll down first of all click on this check my progress and you will get the green tick in this task we don't need to preview the app we just need to test it first of all we need to uh, modify the contact information so for that scroll down a little bit and uh, make sure your id is uh, 51 or anything whatever the value in your case you need to paste that value so first of all copy this email address copy it come back to here and you will automatically see a interface of the uh, customer contact uh, app interface so wait for the app to be loaded up of course ek baat ka dhyan rakhna hai मेक श्योर sure जो भी आपकी आईडी यहाँ पर वैल्यू जो आईडी की वही आपको यहाँ पर कॉपी पेस्ट करनी होगी आपकी केस में 51 के अलावा कुछ और हो सकती है तो वॉट दैट यू नीड टू यूज इन योर केस ओके मेक श्योर योर आईडी इज द वट एवर द आई डी यू आर यूजिंग ओके डोंट गो विद माई आई डी सो वेट फॉर द पेज टू बी लोडेड अप इट इज स्टिल लोडिंग सो वंस योर एप इंटरफेस गेट लोडेड यू नीड टू क्लिक ऑन दिस प्लस आइकन सो वी कैन एड अ न्यू कॉन्टेक्ट सो क्लिक ऑन दिस 
now in the id value you need to paste your id value so i will be typing my one mine that is 51 now you need to paste the email address just that we just copied so paste it here it's showing some latency don't worry my laptop gets hangs let me check yes so now it's working we need to paste the email address here come back to here for the first name and the first name will be the test so copy it come back to here paste it under the first name similarly we will go with the last name so for this copy this contact come back to here let me see yes and paste it under the last name and for the phone copy this contact number very carefully don't copy any extra spacing or any extra number come back to here paste it under here scroll down a little bit click on the save button and we are done with this so it is uh, like a test purpose so click on the save button and me let me check the entry is required yes i paste the entry cut it let me check click on the save button once again yes it's get saved now we are good to go come back to here scroll down a little bit click on the check my progress and you will get the green tick for this task also that is number task number fifth you can see step completed now scroll down you can see uh, there is no other task that we need to complete Congratulations, your lab is completed. We can click on the end lab button now. Click on the submit button. Give the star rating that you want to give. Your lab is now completed. Click on this. Click on the submit button. Now come back to the main page to verify whether we get the green tick or not. We will check this to check whether we have the green tick or not. The lab is completed successfully or not. As the lab is completed, we get the green tick from the green tick. So open the catalog and you can see we get the green tick beside our lab. It means we successfully completed this lab. Okay, so this is the solution of this lab. If you like the video, make sure you hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. If you have any query, you can ask me in the comment box or on the telegram group. So that's it for this video. Thank you very much. Goodbye.